Hello and welcome back to a Madagascar campaign in uh, Beyond Typus. So, yes, I had a look between episodes and it is the Navigator and he is a Diplo guy. So we're gonna waste some money. Um, you're too expensive to fire, but you... We can fire. And then we can dismiss. So, next month, hopefully, fingers crossed, we will get a Colonial Range guy. <laughs> first fucking time. First fucking time. <laughs> Andrian Namponga. Chuli Bookborn in Magnabe. Chuli no, it's, it's Chuliba. It's not Chuli Bookborn. That mm, that would be a funny name. But yes, Colonial Range Guy. Plus, oh, yes. <laughs> so we will send. Oh, we could expel a minority. Oh, that would be real cheap. Expel Sunni minority. What? Sunni isn't a culture. Right? Uh, I'm fairly sure about that. Yeah, Sunni is not a culture. I did not know you could expel purely just religions. So what cultures do we have? They're small. Could do this culture, Nyasa. There's a bunch of it up here as well. Or we could start getting rid of the Ngunis. So the reason we can actually turn this into um, expel minorities is because this is actually a colonial region. Um, do you know, I think I'm just gonna. But if we make if we expel a minority, increases the development by two. Increases the development by three. We could spend 188 and it increases the development by 11. 188 is more than 11 dev clicks right now, but it won't be in the future. Um, hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Now nah, screw it. We'll just do the regular, regular colonists, but this is cheaper as well. 72, 42. Let's do the 42. It's it's just cheaper. Right, and we need to blitz this war. It needs to be a very quick war. Kikonya will join. I don't know where Kikonya is. Uh, do I? No, they're probably somewhere over here. Uh, but we need to blitz this war. They're probably stood in Kalonga, I would guess. So we're going to march straight to Lundu and have a, a cheeky Uganda. Let's go. Uh, it's going to be over Batua. I need to keep this army itself together. All right, he's not there. So let's move into Kalonga. That'll give us vision over here. There is it. There it is. Blech. There he is, even. Move to there. You can go there. Oh, shit. I found him. So... You are on tech 8 as well. This guy is dead, 100%. Well, yeah, we found him. That's him right there. We need to get all our army together. That's the jungle. Let's go and sit in the jungle for a little bit. It's a shame I lost troops, but, you know, it was inevitable. 0% there, very nice. We need to have oh, occupied Mozambique, that's inevitable as well. 
On the one hand, I kind of need to protect that army because it's got my expensive ass cannons in it. But on the other hand, I also need to blitz him a bit more than I am doing. So hopefully you pass, no, well, maybe he's gonna pass before this guy comes down. That would be ideal. 21%, it could happen. I would like to use cannons to kill this guy. He's got one cannon himself. Come on, 35%. We're out of manpower. There we go. You're gonna come over here. You're actually gonna go to Kulmin. Everyone. And then we're gonna try and fight the guy with our entire army all at once. We'll chase him up to Katskera. Hello, Kalonga. Let's all go to Lolo. We'll try and kill him in Kalonga. Oh, it's the hills. I don't wanna fight him in the hills. You're moving to Lomwo. I need to get you there. Hopefully, yeah, we still got him, good. Shift consolidate. Hopefully this is a good smash. Let me smash. See, look, because he's so much more powerful than us. Doesn't matter that we had so many more men. He probably still killed more than we did. So you're going to retreat all the way up here. Oh, yes, please do move here. That would be glorious. 10th of September is fine. Oh, no, you fucker. So what we're going to do is take away two troops. You're going to go and de siege all four of these provinces. Meanwhile, I'm going to sit here and wait. I don't take any attrition here, so I can just happily gain some dudes back. Uh, wouldn't, would have preferred to keep the morale guy. Yearly inflation reduction seems quite nice. I want to get this idea group filled out for that dev cost. And we are sitting in the hills, so if he wants to fight me, he's going to have to go into the hills. Or he could try and de-siege Masapa, and we'll fuck him up there. We only have two shock. He has fucking one, so that's a good spot in our favor. Let's go over here. With any luck, he won't move. And we'll be able to smash him with three one odds. Colony damaged, yeah, that was expected. That's fine, it was just a roll of the dice, I guess. Nope, he's running away. Uh, he's got more troops now than we do. They're all in the same place. So what I could do is just peace out for a smaller amount of land. That's a, that's a hefty chunk of land, actually. I could almost I could turn him into a one province miner. Honestly, I think that's worth it. That is definitely worth it. Katskera is eleven dev, which is actually pretty decent. Let's, uh, but this is a province I already have provinces in. Kalonga, I want all of that. Mm, you're three dev. We'll, we'll let you keep this one then. We'll take this. We'll let you keep this. And we'll take away some money. Oh, really? <laughs> Freaking really? I guess because this is 11 dev, that's why he was willing to do it. You let him keep Lomway as well. Uh, sure. And then we can take a smidge more money. Yeah, that, that seems fine. He's a separated two dev um, nation. That's fine. So, lots of cores to make again, and I don't have too many admin points again. Yay, uh, again. We don't have anything to uh, get some points right now. Actually, with my increase of colonial range, go to Mahe. Give me. Three dudes with the dude and explore. Yeah, there we go. The the sea and then the thing, and you can uh, protect trade here. 
All right, lovely. That's all worked out just fine. And we will also send our colonist back over here. Oh, you know what? This was shitty. This was shitty that this failed because it's costing me diplo points that I don't really have. But we're going to do it again regardless. We're going to send pretty much the entire army over here. Um, all of this land that we've just taken is fetishist, so it doesn't matter that we increase the autonomy here. Do I have an increased autonomy uh, uh, hockey? No. So we're just going to do this just to stave off rebellion. It's almost not enough as well. This, the rebellion chance has gone up here, but it's still at 0%. Yeah, I'm not sure what happens when you flip too soon E. Because, like, obviously there's, um, I have to choose a, a school, right? But I don't know how that happens. I don't know how one chooses a school. Is it like you get a pop-up when you flip and it's like, oh yeah, now you need to choose a school of thought. That would be pretty cool, actually. I hope it's that. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, hurry up. There we go. So I'm going to shift consolidate and we're going to take the cannons as well. So you're going to stay behind. There's 15 troops at almost full strength. Get on the boats and land straight on the province. Landing straight on the province is, is kind of the important part here. It has the leader as well, not that the leader's any good. Trading in ivory happened to us. Diplo rep plus two, that's pretty good. And we managed to stay here. We don't get any uh, attrition from sitting here. We have enough troops to defend it. I think this is going to be pretty good. Still no Europeans? Still no Europeans. Good, good, good. All right, lovely. Well, um... I was going to say, and with that we'll take a break, but it's only been 12 minutes, so... Yeah, nah. So these guys, I mean, the 6k troops here, when it's finished, getting, uh... Getting fixed. So, fuck it, you guys can just sit here and do all of this stuff. And over here, we're going to need a bit more Diplo Rep. I start legitimacy is high again. Um, why are you pissed off? What happened? I guess you've probably just taken Diplotech. And that's made it a lot worse. Tell you what then, um, let's... Should I tank my prestige a little bit? I don't need this anymore, but I will get a claim on both these provinces. I need 25 there. Don't have it. All right, whatever. Um, bu -bu -bu -bum. I need to get you happy. Uh, so, who's got the best provinces? 15 dev, 10 dev, 5 dev. So, you, Malahafi, and Saklava. And we're going to annex the both of you with this. There we go. Alright, we're going to annex the both of them. It shouldn't take too long. Like there. You jumped up to 13%. It's going to take less than a year, so it's perfect. And that's going to stop you from... Well, I mean, it's going to piss you off, of course. But at the same time, it's going to stop you from rebelling. Because you're going to lose 8k troops. And I am going to gain 8k troops. It's going to be beautiful. It's glorious. No problem whatsoever. Uh, natives lose 500 size. This is the problem, yeah. Or attempt to assuage their pain. Easy, easy choice. Uh, the Ottomans are preparing to attack Genoa. Do I even know of the Ottomans? Oh, I do. I know the Ottomans exist. I don't know who Genoa is. Adran and Ethiopia are at war as well. That's a thing that's happening. Uh, we never really did get our thing with Madol. Melindy, do you want to be a friend of mine? Yeah, as soon as we have, um... Annex these guys. I'm going to 
ally with Melindy, and hopefully he's going to give me knowledge sharing. You didn't go up. Why? Because you're pissed off again. Fuck. Why? How can we get that better? Tell you what, I know how. Hey, Melindy, how you doing? Have a bit of dev. Is that enough? Mm, it is. I can do it with bits of Masakura as well. Uh, you can also have some dev. Alright, that should be enough. 96%. Beautiful. Also, my colonist seems to have perished. I don't have any Diplo points. That's a shame. So next year, you'll be, sorry, next month you'll be finished and we'll start annexing Pitsumisakura as well. And done. Yay, prestige and stuff. So are you pissed off? No, we can actually do it right now. He's not below 192 yet. I wonder. It's still not below 192. Sometimes when you hover over it, it like updates and screws you up. But there, look, six extra troops. We got also another cog and another bark. I guess you can go join over here. So you'll be finished and I'll get three more barks. No one's pissed off still, it's good. High income, I still want, don't want to do that. I'm gonna save this one, I think, for a while. population in our colony that's good we're now at 360 which is sweet you're going to protect trade over here as well this one cog I'll just leave it here in case I need to like ship dudes over this way got Sunni zealots still at 0% we're gonna have a Sunni province here we've also got a Sunni province here we could lower the unrest here Hopefully you switch to Sunni. Hang on. Um, let's take the missionary away from here. And send him here. And hopefully that'll flip him to being Sunni separatists. Come on. Sunni zealots. Yes. Beautiful. Alright, and I'm also going to get my troops... You know, the fastest way is probably if you're over here, and you're over here as well. We'll get that all squared away. Uh, we're out of Diplo points, unfortunately, so we can't actually annex these guys anymore. It's going to happen just over time, slowly. But that's fine. That's fine. It's worth it. Gets you both up pretty close to each other, so one person isn't going to be super pissed off for very long. It's just like we can't do two at once, really. Uh, also, we should probably core all these provinces. Including Il Bourbon. What would what would the na uh, natives call Il Bourbon? I'm gonna check that between episodes and rename it because that does not sound like a Malagasy name. Uh, we could escalate the complaint, gain ten loyalty, or we could get Matapa's opinion of us up. Easy freaking choice there, son. Um. Oh, we can also demand 150 diplo points. Ah, oh, yes. So you're both gonna get annexed. You might even both get annexed next month. It's possible. If not, it's going to be the month after. Yeah, just the month after. Never mind. Alright, you're going to move down here, and we've got another cog that can help transport dudes. Maku is all cored. Yeah, all that shit's cored. Good, good, good. Maquana, we can core that. We can state that it's got three dev. Yeah, that, that's not going to be a thing for a little while, I don't think. You can also move up here. And you can protect trade also over there. Lovely. That's pretty nice. You're getting your men back. You're doing that. Are we over our force limit? I imagine probably. Oh, wow. Yes, we most certainly are. I need to fix that immediately. Uh, well, for starters... Fucking kill all these guys. That puts us at 36 out of 30, so I need to kill six dudes. Well, I don't like calves, so go away. You're all infantry. There's two more cav here, we'll kill those.
that puts us at 26 out of 22. Um, this province is probably super happy with me, right? Yeah. I could lower dev. Sorry, lower the un autonomy. Let's do that. Mahalafalafali. can probably do it here as well. You're going to be a Sunni zealot, I hope. That should fix our problems a bit. Even so, we're, we're probably going to be able to hold on to this. 11 troops there, 15 over there, 26 total. It's not too bad. Uh, let's go to 24 total, so let's give it a couple more. Seems reasonable. 24 out of 22. I'm happy with that. We're, uh, we're only losing... How much are we losing specifically from over, extent, uh, over force limit? 133. I can deal with that. That's fine. So now making three ducats a month, which is pretty decent. And is there any buildings I would like to build? Ten. Uh, here. No. Uh, marketplaces, perhaps? Maybe. We'll, we'll, we'll keep an eye on it. Uh, roads. Wow, we can make better roads now as well. Uh, I guess because it's cheap, Imhambane, you, you, and you can have roads. And we'll leave it at that. And we'll also leave the episode at that because it's time to put a cut in. So I hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, if you did, feel free to click the like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And I will see you guys in the next one. And holy shit, that Bamanis is huge. See you next time, guys. Bye-bye.